I want to start with men's brains. All right. Now, men's brains are, are very unique. Men's brains are made up of little boxes. And we have a box for everything. We've got a box for the car. We've got a box for the money. We've got a box for the job. We've got a box for you. We've got a box for the kids. We've got a box for your mother somewhere in the basement. We've got, we got, we, we got boxes everywhere. And, and the rule is, the boxes don't touch. When a man discusses a particular subject, we go to that particular box, we pull that box out, we open the box, we discuss only what is in that box. All right? And, and, and then we close the box and put it away being very, very careful not to touch any other boxes. Now, women's brains are very, very different from men's brains. Women's brains are made up of a big ball of wire. And everything is connected to everything. And the money's connected to the car, and the car's connected to your job, and your kids are connected to your mother, and everything's connected to everything. And it's, like... and, and, and it's all driven by energy that we call emotion. It's just... It's, it's, it's one of the reasons why women tend to remember everything. <laughs> because if you take an event and you connect it to an emotion, it burns in your memory and you can remember it forever. The same thing happens for men. It just doesn't happen very often because, quite frankly, we don't care. <laughs> uh, now, men, we have a box in our brain that most women are not aware of. This particular box has nothing in it. <laughs> in fact, we call it the nothing box. <laughs> and of all the boxes a man has in his brain, the nothing box is our favorite box. <laughs> a man can do something seemingly completely brain dead for hours on end. You know, like fishing. And we love it. That's, that's why a guy can sit in front of a TV and go. Of course, this drives our wives nuts because they'll come up and say, Stop that! You can't possibly be watching anything! I'm not. of Pennsylvania a couple of years ago did a study and discovered that men have the ability to think about absolutely nothing and still breathe. <laughs> Women can't do it. They can't do it. Their minds never stop. <laughs> and, and they don't understand the nothing box. And it drives them crazy. Because nothing drives a woman more crazy or makes her feel more irritated than to witness a man doing nothing! <laughs> and I've had women say, oh, oh it's nothing. Well, can I go in a nothing box with him? Besides, you'll walk in there and go, you know, you know this place could really use some pictures. <laughs> Nice little table over here, some flowers, is it? No! Now this handles the way men, men and women handle stress. Okay? When a man is stressed out, all he wants to do is run to his nothing box. A woman will see a man in that vegetative state and she'll come up and go... What you thinking about? Nothing. <laughs> we got to think about something. No, I think about nothing. <laughs> now, when a woman is stressed out, she has to talk about it. If 
she doesn't talk about it, her brain will literally explode. <laughs> See, a lot of guys, they feel obligated when, when you start explaining all your stress, they feel obligated to fix you. Right? Because that's what a man does. A man only tells his troubles to another man in hopes that that man will help fix it. Okay? But she's not a man. And you try and fix her, she's going to kill you. Right? Vice. She doesn't want your help. She wants you to shut up and listen. And a couple of ladies. That's right. You tell 